Okay, this is a tutorial on follow actions uh, to create little glitchy sounds to incorporate into your music somehow. Um, I'll get straight into it. Uh, get yourself an audio channel. Um, find yourself some percussive hits, or you can experiment with it all. But I'm going to use some of these. You can tab down, click one at the top, tab down, and hold shift, press. Drag them in. They've all lined up. You can press command and they will go uh, horizontally as well. Uh, we'll select all in here. Let's warp on. Um, make sure your launch parts open here. We've got uh, trigger legato. We don't want legato on, we want it to trigger. We want it to follow the global quantization, no velocity, follow action. These, this is bars. This, I think, is eighth notes, and this will be sixteenth notes. This is where your actions are. We want to randomize it, so we'll click any. I'm going to turn this down so the quick sixteenth notes. Yeah. And this hopefully should <laughs> clip a lot. Uh. Okay, that's it. So now we can bounce these down into another audio channel. Resample. Um hit record on here um, off we go um, I think I've actually got my mic on here but for this purpose obviously I won't or oh, some should have done something somehow <laughs> um, now that you've got that you can take that over to the other page here I already, I already have one that I made earlier, um, which is here. Um, I then proceeded to chop them up. Um, I'll give you a listen to that. I've pitched, I've pitched stuff up, uh, faded stuff in, reverse stuff, uh, just, just messed about with them really. Okay. Right, um, and there's a drum beat here for it as well. was the original I think we're still playing on the other page but okay I hope that was helpful not the best tutorial but there you go thank you